coming. Thank you. I've been working on this product for a while, and I just didn't want to miss today. So <laughs> thank you for having me. But I've got a few updates uh, for you. Uh, the first thing I'd like to talk about is iBooks. We launched the iBook store less than a year ago. One of the milestones we've hit is that users have downloaded over 100 million books in less than a year. Today, we're announcing uh, that Random House, the largest trade publisher, over 17,000 books to the iBook store. And uh, we have now over 2,500 publishers uh, distributing through the iBook store. We have iTunes, the App Store, and iBooks. 200 million accounts. And these are accounts with credit cards and one-click purchasing. We recently just paid out over $2 billion to the developers. A lot of people have tried to copy this. I think we're way ahead. And you can understand why developers want to write their apps for the App Store. The iPhone, we recently shipped our 100 million iPhone. So, a lot of stuff going on, and it's all good. Today we're here to talk about Apple's third post-PC blockbuster product. And in one with the iPod, right? Our first post-PC product. 2007, we added the iPhone. 2010, we added the iPad. Less than a year ago, we said it's our most advanced technology in a magical and revolutionary device at an unbelievable price. People weren't sure that it was an unbelievable price. Well, let me tell you, ask our competitors now. <laughs> and they'll tell you. 2010 turned out to be the year of the iPad. We sold almost 15 million iPads in 2010. And remember, that's just nine months. That's more than every tablet PC ever sold. And it generated a little shy of $10 billion in revenue for Apple. Many have said this is the most successful consumer product ever launched. Over 90% market share. Our competitors were just <laughs> flummoxed. They went back to the drawing boards. They tore up their designs. There was one uh, Samsung got out last year. And uh, you might have heard the quote that they said. As you heard, our selling was quite aggressive, around 2 million. In terms of sellout, we believe it was quite small. Our app store has over 350,000 apps in it. Over 65,000 of those now take full advantage of the iPad. That compares to our competitors who are trying to launch these days with, at most, 100 apps. What about 2011? Everybody's got a tablet. Is 2011? <laughs> going to be the year of the copycats? I think if we did nothing, maybe a little bit, probably not so much, because most of these tablets aren't even catching up with the first iPad. But we haven't been resting on our laurels. In less than a year, we're going to introduce today iPad 2, the second generation iPad. All new design. It is not a tweaked design. It's not got marginal improvements. It's a completely new design. It's dramatically faster. It's great. It's dual core processors. And so we get up to twice as fast on CPU performance, up to nine times faster graphics. Same low power as A4. We don't want to give up any of that legendary battery life. This is going to be the first dual core tablet to ship in volume. Second. We've built in some cameras. We've got a rear camera out the back, and we've got a front-facing camera out the front. The gyroscope that we have in the iPhone and the iPod Touch. One of the most startling things about the iPad 2 is it is dramatically thinner, a third thinner, 33% thinner. That's what it looks like. Gone from 13.4 millimeters down to 8.8 .8 millimeters thick. iPad 2 is actually thinner than your iPhone 4. All of these other tablets are coming out, most of them even thicker than the original iPad. It's lighter as well. 
going from 1.5 pounds down to 1.3. It comes in two colors, <laughs> black and white. We're going to be shipping white from day one. <laughs> so. And to give you some scale, this is what it looks like. Again, you can just pick this thing up. It almost floats. And we have the same legendary 10-hour battery life as the original iPad. We've also preserved the price. And you add all of this together with over 65,000 apps. We think 2011 is going to be the year of iPad 2. So when are we going to ship it? April, May, June? No. On March 11th, that's a so 26 countries or more on March 25th. And that is iPad 2. We've got some really cool accessories. The first one we've had a lot of requests for, HDMI video out. Teachers want to hook iPads up to their flat screen TVs in the classroom so that everybody can see, et cetera, et cetera. So anything you can see on the iPad screen, you see on HDMI. And so here it is on a HDTV, all smart covers. It's a smart cover. And this is what it looks like. And it bends and folds around just like this as a typing stand and to watch movies on, just like the, the old one. Looks great with black, looks great with white. They come in polyurethane, which is used to make spacesuits, uh, or leather. And let's run that video. What would these cases be if they didn't come in colors? So we've got five polyurethane colors and five colors of uh, leather. Uh, let's see if I can line this up right, like this, and you can you know, grab your head and pull it away. Uh, <laughs> you, you can take a picture of yourself doing it, so let me see if I can do that. So here I am. And next is FaceTime. Watch FaceTime here. You can see I have my buddy list on the right. So I'll go right. So I'll go ahead and choose Michael. Great. I was just giving everyone here a demo of FaceTime. You can see already that this camera. So Michael, why don't you flip to the rear camera and show us what you're looking at? Sure thing, Scott. OK, Michael's been locked in a, a very sad cafe. GarageBand for iPad. Great set of features. Again, this is no toy. This is something that you can really use for real work. This is something that I cannot tell you how many hours teenagers are going to spend making music with this. GarageBand for iPad, $4.99. iPad 2, an amazing product. Faster, lighter, thinner. Cameras and gyro, iOS 4.3 with built-in FaceTime and Photo Booth, iMovie and GarageBand for $4.99 each on the App Store, over 65,000 apps that have been tuned for the iPad to take advantage of all its resources. Same 10-hour battery life, the same prices starting at $4.99. Black and white. Smart covers. We think 2011 is clearly going to be the year of iPad 2. Go get your hands on one of these things. You won't believe it. Thank you very much.